Hey everyone, hopefully this should work this week, this webcam, um, and if not, obviously you're not seeing it. Um, so I'm hoping I won't have to re-record this like I did last week. Um, okay, so I guess I'll get started. I don't have much to talk about today. Um, Christine, I completely agree that Valentine's Day is over-commercialized. I know that if I was in a relationship, I... Definitely. First of all, I would not want one of those giant teddy bears because I'm like, what would I do with it? Okay, maybe a small something, and it didn't even necessarily have to be a teddy bear because, I mean, teddy bears are cute, but they're not, like, my favorite thing in the world. But I completely agree, like, things should be scaled down a bit, and yeah, so I agree with you. And I'm sorry about your fractured rib. That doesn't sound fun at all. Um, so I hope you get better soon. And her question was, what is the easiest and hardest subject for you in school? Um, the easiest, if we're talking like standard stuff, like math, science, English, social studies, um, I've always had a real good time, or like, not real good as in fun, but like, I've had an easy time with math. Um, my dad majored in math in college, and I think I got some of his math smarts. So... Um, I always did well, except for in pre-calc, but that's probably because I missed, like, half the classes and then dropped at semester. So, <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, let's see. So, math was easy. Um, also, like you said, chemistry. I really liked chemistry. And I was in AP Chem last year for a semester, and then I had to drop at semester because I couldn't keep up because last year I got really sick again. Um, as for hardest subjects... People say, like, that I'm good at, I'm probably good at writing, like, actual physical, but I'm not good at, like, rhetoric, like, analyzing rhetoric kind of stuff, like, figurative language and stuff like that. I'm not, I'm not good at that. Um, I just interpret things differently. And people always say, like, oh, there's no wrong answer in English. I honestly, I stop believing that there's, there is a right and a wrong answer. The right answer is what the teacher thinks is the right answer. Personally, that's my belief. I don't really like it. And also, I have a hard time with biology because it's kind of like the same thing. Um, like, there's more than one answer and, like, things get complicated and confusing. So, yeah. Um, but if we're also talking about, like, other electives and stuff, I was usually pretty good at French. Um, and I am good at... I'd like to think I'm good at graphics, and orchestra is, like, a good class for me, too. Um, so, yeah, but sometimes in orchestra, I've, I have trouble concentrating on the music. So, yeah, I'm rambling. I'll stop. <laughs> um, my question for this week is, do you see a psychiatrist? I don't, you don't have to tell me details about why or whatever. It doesn't matter. I'm just wondering if you do or not, because... I see one. I do not see a therapist currently. I did at one point. I don't anymore. Um, so yeah, so my week has been really boring. I really haven't done anything. This time of year is really boring for me usually. I'm not doing a whole lot. So see, I don't even remember if I did anything. Right. Oh, you know what? Saturday I went to the mall with my friend and we were there for like six hours. <laughs> but we did go out to eat there too. So um, so I was at the mall with her, and that was fun. She bought me a Cinnabon, because I drove. <laughs> um, Sunday I didn't really feel well, and then Monday and Tuesday I was home from school. Um, and today, I saw my psychiatrist, like, that's kind of where my question came from. And, um, <laughs> funny thing is that when we were coming back from the psychiatrist, and my mom was going to drop us off at school, um, we, in the road that we were taking to go to school, there's an intersection at one point, and it goes, it, there's three lanes, and then there's the stoplight, and then it goes two lanes on the other side, and there was a semi-truck who was in the third lane, the lane that stops, and he wanted to get into our lane, but we were still in the lane, and we were there, and he definitely started to veer into our lane, and my mom had to swerve to avoid him, but if somebody would have been in the other, the lane to the left of me, to, uh, 
to the left of our car, we would have gotten in an accident either way, because if we would have swerved to avoid the semi-truck, we would have gotten hit by the other car, but if we hit the semi-truck, then we would have hit the semi-truck, so... That was not fun. I screamed because he was coming towards my side of the car, <laughs> which was not fun. So, um, that's really all for me this week. Um, I'm sorry if I, you know, this is a short video. Um, I, like I said, this is a really boring time of year for me. Um, so yeah, I hope you all are doing really well and I hope to see a few more videos this week. That would be nice. And until next week, I'll see you guys later. Bye.